640, that's the number of deadly police involved shootings that have occurred in the U.S. this year, according to the Washington Post. 13 of those happened here in Virginia. 10 News reporter Magdala Lusand spoke with a local organization helping those officers recover from the mental trauma and an Amherst County deputy who went through the experience just this past weekend. Lieutenant Elsie Cash has been in law enforcement more than 20 years. He's had to fire his weapon several times in his career, most recently this past Sunday. No police officer wants to go out there and take somebody's life. And unfortunately, as part of our job, sometimes that happens. Cash was one of the three Amherst County deputies who got in a gun battle when they tried to pull over a Waynesboro man wanted in connection to a killing in Nelson County. State police say Anthony Hutchinson led deputies in a pursuit, crashed his car, and then opened fire. One deputy was struck in the leg. Hutchinson was shot and killed. Cash describes how he felt that day. Heavy emotions, a huge adrenaline dump. I mean, you, you get the physiological responses and... Uh, you know, the emotional responses, you just, you know, it's not something you ever want to have to do. Sunday's shooting was the second in less than a year for the Amherst County Sheriff's Office, and it's the second time the agency is calling on the organization VA LEAP, an assistant program that helps officers cope after a traumatic event. We create opportunities. Uh, we don't create the solutions. We don't fix people. We don't fix law enforcement officers. We create opportunities for people to fix themselves. Eric Mullen is a lieutenant with the Franklin County Sheriff's Office and a VA LEAP board member. He and Kit Cummings say since 2009, their programs have helped more than 1,500 law enforcement officers in the Commonwealth get back to work. We offer a post-critical incident seminar, which is quite different. It is much more in depth. It is a three-day event uh, with clinical assistance. For Lieutenant Cash, he's taken it day by day, but just having started his recovery process with VA LEAP, he already feels safe. To dare to listen and, and to not be judgmental and, and it allows us to have a safe place to, to sit there and, and talk and let our emotions, you know, run the natural course. In Amherst County, Magdala Lusant, 10 News, working for you.